सो हेलो गाइस सो टुडे वी हैव दिस कॉम्बिनेशन दैट इज अ कूल कॉम्बिनेशन लाइक ट्रे आई डी दैट इज आई गेस आई हैव कवर्ड दिस वन इन वन ऑफ माई शॉर्ट्स सो इट्स अ फ्री आई डी विच गिवस लाइक जेमिन आई टू पॉइंट फाइव प्रो एंड ऑल्सो क्लॉथ थ्री पॉइंट सेवन सॉन एट लाइक क्रेजी सो दे हैव जस्ट रिलीज देयर एम सी पी सपोर्ट सो प्रीवियसली दे डेंट हैव द एम सी पी सपोर्ट सो दे हैव करेंटली रिलीज इट आई शो यू नाउ एंड ऑल्सो दिस कॉन्टेक्ट सेवन दैट इज बाई अपस्टैश सो दिस इज अ कूल लाइक currently i feel it's the best mcp server because it has context of uh, about all latest documentation sites so let me show you first let's go to tray ai uh, sorry tray ai id yeah so you can download this um, we can go to i don't see their change logs uh, let me see uh, i don't see their change logs but yep they have just released their mcp servers uh, support Uh, so Gemini 2.5 Pro, uh, Gemini GPT 4.1 uh, also available. So for free everything. But yeah, you can download uh, Tray ID. I have already installed it uh, in my uh, PC. So yeah, you can see this one. Uh, first, before going deeping, uh, before going to show you the code and how it works, let me show the context seven. So here is the context seven. So it was by uh, Upstash company. So yeah, um, it has like around where is it? Um, I can't find the number. Yep, it has uh, around three nine four zero libraries. So can you imagine that? Like three nine four zero documentation sites. So yeah, it has like everything: Next.js, Elastic, Laravel, Clark, MongoDB, everything. Everything it has covered. You can search like everything. Like if I search Versal AI SDK, yep, uh, you got there. Uh, I guess everything is covered. I have uh, searched uh, a lot of like. Uh, known uh, less known uh, libraries also they are available that also so yeah you can uh, now the question is how can you use that so let's go to mcp server so yep this is mcp server uh, their mcp server and you just need to copy this thing this uh, this config where you, like you have to put this in your ids like we used to put it in cursor winsor uh, and now today will i will be showing you how to use it inside mc like uh, sorry uh, tray id so i guess you have installed uh, the tray id so let's go to tray id so here will be the interface look like uh, like this so what you have to do is like mm, this is the tray uh, chat uh, like uh, the chat ui and what you need to do is you just need to go to settings and go to mcp yep mcp so yeah i already have it so what you can do is like add go to add and you can choose from marketplace uh, because means it has all the like uh, known uh, mcp servers like slack gitlab github uh, puppeteer all the known resources and also you can configure manually so you have to just go configure manually and go to raw configure json and you need to put the like what we have copied i uh, have to put this here uh, so then we can access our context 7 mcv server cool i guess you understood that okay so next what we have to do is like uh, we can tag the builder like uh, for without tagging the builder it will uh, behave, behave like a chat and not an agent so for the agent setup uh, like for the agent to uh, invoke we need to give uh, this one like at the rate and uh, builder for like just the builder without mcp and builder with mcp will what we need to choose and uh, suppose i want to create uh, create a next js uh, app yep setup setup sorry setup a next js app yep let's go also i have choose gemini uh, 2.5 pro here you can choose like uh, cloud 3.5 sonnet 3.7 sonnet like uh, i guess gemini 2.5 pro is the best currently so yeah <coughs> so yes the setup is ready now so there were some issues and like uh, the ai itself solved it so no worries so uh, so now what we can do is we can uh, provide rules like we used to have cursor dot cursor rules in like cursor so we also have this uh, create project rules uh, and we, we can also provide user rules but uh, this will be a global rules and for project rules we need to create a project rule suppose yeah this is a project rule we need to provide the rules suppose i already have uh, some rules 
that I used earlier, this one. Like uh, what this does is like use this MCP tool uh, for like uh, implement something any specific library since it contains latest docs for any library. So we are telling it to use the tool MCP tool that we just ingested here in the MCP and also use Tailwind and PNPM. Oh sorry, we are not using PNPM now. So yeah, we will be removing this. Okay, cool. So now you got to know the rules thing. So it's just like dot cursor rules and uh, yeah now what we can do is we can give our idea like uh, I have one idea that is this one so I want to create a split bill web app so it's like generally uh, splitting the bill after like any uh, in general so splitting the bill among uh, many people so yeah we'll be using this model and also this library tool for MCP and yeah this thing uh, also we have already set up the next years so yeah let's try this out and i'm also using gemini 2.5 pro cool let's go so you can see that too many current requests your queue position is four five like, it, like it's decreasing so yeah you you may face that because it's totally free so yeah then uh, what you can do is like uh, you can also switch to another model like if um, the queue is long for now though it's just three but if the queue is long enough so you can switch to like other, other models uh, like cloud 3.7 sonnet or anything other so finally it is ready so it's currently running on localhost 3000 so let's check this out so yep here it is and uh, let's uh, give it a bill so I have downloaded one bill from Google so this is one restaurant bill so let's uh, analyze with Gemini mm -hmm. yep this is it so these are the items and we can have like I am already there uh, we can have other names like Neil uh, we can add then we can uh, like add Bob and uh, suppose all, only three of us are there and we have to split so we can choose it from here um, I have written this I have written this uh, Bob have written this Bob has written this and Neil uh, Neil has written only this okay so then finally we get the total amount for each of us the bill is split so yeah like uh, you can see that how cool it is like uh, I have used the MCP server of this uh, context 7 and the free models of like uh, Tray AI IDE. So yes, it's a good, like a great combination of uh, this Tray IDE and uh, MCP servers. And yes, uh, do check it, check this out. And if you face any problem, any difficulties, do comment it down in the video section, uh, comment section. And if you like the video, do like it, share, subscribe and all those stuff. And let's see in our next video. Till then, peace.